done now I guess we're done painting and we're about to leave we took pictures and we're so cute because our pictures <laughs> but yeah guys we are done now we're gonna head home I had so much fun that was too that was too good that was too good thank you for this day babe oh the lighting looks to one thing yeah please guys let's push let's push let's push also please do follow her channel because she's doing an amazing job she's like popular and stuff like oh my god so cheer guys we're gonna leave now bye Hey dolls, hi guys, I hope you guys are well. Um I'm currently editing this vlog, literally. I'm currently editing and I just saw my I don't have an uh, outro and I didn't tell you guys how the clay cafe works and you know just in case you guys would love to go or visit one day how do I know Lunabo so I know Lunabo through Instagram I've been following her for like quite a minute now for but yeah I've been following I think I started following her this year I think so if you don't like late last year i'm not sure but i think this year but yeah so and uh, i discovered her channel this year as well and i've been watching some of her vlogs and new diaries and she's such a nice person person oh person <laughs> she's such a nice person and she's so real she's so genuine and we have so much in common and recently there's no going on the ig here and there you know complimenting each other here and there and whatever and i was just like you know what let me shoot my friendship sh uh, shot and i thought you know what let me ask her on a date like let's go on a date girl and then i did and she was keen guys she was keen she didn't say no she was keen and was supposed to go the previous saturday but um something came up so we couldn't and then we ended up going on the wednesday the following week after my exam my last paper we went to clay cafe and it was such a cute like date idea going to clay cafe has to be one of the best ideas because it's so calm it's so cute you get to share like your creative side so you get to chat while painting you get to eat while painting it's very cute and calm and yeah i'd, I'd suggest it no one can hear it, honestly it's so nice it's so nice it's so calm like like there's nice music playing oh it's just cute and i can't explain it honestly i can't so we went to clay cafe right and i also want to explain how the clay cafe thing works right so first of all what is clay cafe so a clay cafe is like a studio restaurant where you can sit down eat and paint an object so it could be a cup a bowl a plate whatever right so we went to clay cafe at on Bree street um there are many branches and there's a clay cafe i think it's going help a um it wasn't in doubt but you know we went to the one in Bree street so how it works is to be in clay cafe or the studio let me just call it the studio you have to pay 45 rands right so this is per person so if you buy two no you should not butter for five rand if you buy six no six no butter for five rands right to be in the studio and then they will come to your table they will explain how it works different techniques what to do what not to do um etc etc 
and then they will take you down to show you the different types of paints and how they look um after the glazing i i think it's called glazing i think the process is called glazing yeah how the paints will look after the glazing and how they look before the glazing um so that you have an idea of how your art will come out they'll also um show you like the different objects there's so many there's like a variety guys there's everything unicorns rabbits shoes um everything honestly so you can pick which one you want and obviously they have different prices i went with a cup and the cup was like 115 or 120 i'm not sure between the two though 115 between 115 and 120 and then Ulunaba went for this hot object um yeah i don't know what to call it but she went for that and i don't know how much it was but it had its own price and most of the objects are not um less than 100 rands and very few is less than 100 rands so just be just be prepared that you'll probably spend more than 100 rands for an object and then you're only allowed to um take three paints so three colors only you can't have more than three colors that's just the policy that's just the rule so yeah you can only use three colors and yeah basically you get your work after a few weeks i think they said five if i'm not mistaken so you get your artwork after five weeks if it doesn't break during the glazing process guys i hope it's called the glazing process because if it's not i literally die because i'm out here saying glazing but yeah that's how it works basically so we sat down we ate all the self food the food is really good which is not expected because it specializes with like art paints and stuff not really food so i didn't expect their food to be like good but their food was really good and also i had this slushy oh my gosh their slushy was so good it was a watermelon something slushy but it had it had lime and had and there's my it was very nice though i've never had that before and i think they wrote the ingredients down underneath the name or something i think this was a tata dense because that was too good it was really good like i've never tasted it's slushy that good so yeah um so paint us and we got to know each other obviously um took pictures which was Taking Ufa to Angulungam Kailanga is so. I don't know. It never, never, honestly, because like I don't know what to do. I don't know how to pose. I don't know if I'm doing too much or what. But I felt so comfortable. It felt so genuine. Like the energy, guys, I don't know. Energy doesn't lie. I feel like everything was just flowing. The conversation was just flowing. We were just getting along. There was no like awkward moments. Okay, let me not lie. When I got there, were a bit awkward obviously because it's like kind banana and you know so but like you know but after like five minutes so i started right to guys honestly like everything was just flowing and she's just such a nice girl she's so nice oh my god she's so nice and okay and first my vlog 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 because i wasn't really vlogging i was shy and she was like vlog 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 please don't mind the um, airplanes <laughs> i live close to the airport so it gets busy around these times but yeah guys that's clay cafe and that's my date with an we'll probably have a second date and i can't wait to get my cup back hopefully it won't break i really can't wait i think i'm gonna give it to my mom as like a gift i don't know we'll see i hope she won't watch till this far because now i spoiled it <sighs> but anyways um yeah that's clay cafe and that's my date with lunabo and i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog it was a really short vlog but um yeah i didn't wanna make you guys wait and you know because i haven't been posting because of school and now that school's over like what am i waiting for you know i thought i'd make a weekly vlog but i was just like you know what if i like post the days separately I don't know if I'm making sense, but if I do, it's, it gives me more content. And if Ben sends a, like a weekly vlog, it would be one video. It wouldn't be much content. Content. It would just be one video. So I'm trying to do that. I'm trying to post my videos one by one. Um, 
yeah i'll see you in vlogmas maybe next year guys i'm sorry but not this year i'm still trying to figure out this youtube love vlogging and everything so yeah and also if you might see i'm not even gonna be awkward or i look crusty or whatever i have a really bad flu yeah it's probably a flu not even a fever because it's so bad like oh and that's also maybe another reason why i didn't shoot the, the outro because after that day i think then i got dola or something or maybe the slushy i don't know but oh go and go like i literally fled a bit a bit in literally touch medication eat sleep oh go so today been finished a bit better shame i won't lie i'm out of bed and i'm chilling with people and i'm all like you know i'm being me but like if you is a corner and their headaches is a corner so i'm not sure what it's about because i also have an event tomorrow and i was supposed to go do my hair but i couldn't do the cola uh good and i have to go with my hair like this now to the event but it's fine it's not the end of the world but anyways i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog um stay tuned for more vlogs i love you guys thank you for the support please don't stop supporting me we are almost at a thousand subscribers please guys help me get there it will really mean a lot to me and yeah happy holidays be safe <laughs>